I'm Anil Kumar sharing with you a very important test question based on harmonic mean. The harmonic mean is defined as sum of 1 over nxi to the power of minus 1 where n is the number of values in the set of data. The question here is use a harmonic mean to find the average price of gasoline for a driver who bought $1.20 worth of 65 cents per liter last week and another $1.20 worth at 70 cents per liter this week. Part B is describe the type of calculation for which harmonic mean is useful. Now in this particular example you'll notice that this amount $1.20 is constant in both the cases. That is kind of critical to use this formula, right? Now, we could straight away apply the formula here. Sum of 1 over n, in our case, there are two transactions, right? So in our case, n is equal to 2. x1 is 65 cents, we say 0, 0.65, and x2 is 70 cents, right? So 0 0.70. So these are two values given to us. So applying the formula, we get 1 over 2 times 0 0.65, so we are writing in cents, plus 1 over 2 times 70, right? And everything to the power of minus 1, correct? Now, you could take a common denominator and solve this. So we have everything to the power of, so we, we just multiply this, 0 0.70 plus 0 0.65. The denominator will be 2 times 0 0.65 times 0 0.70, correct? To the power of minus 1. So let's calculate this. So we have 0 0.7 plus 0 0.65 which is equal to this number and we'll divide this number by product of all that which is within brackets let me write 2 times 0 0.65 times 0 0.7 and that is equal to let me write here that is equal to 135 over 91 to the power of minus 1 now so that is 91 over 135, correct? So let me do 91 divided by 135 uh, in decimals. That gives us around 0 0.6740. Is it okay? Now that is what our harmonic mean is. So our answer in this particular case is, is dollar uh, 0 0.67 you can say approximately right so so many dollars per liter correct so that is how you could calculate the harmonic mean now part two of this question is describe the type of calculation for which harmonic mean is useful now it is very useful wherever we have something constant like x times y equals to a constant so in these situations it is very useful for example we know distance so distance is speed into time correct so so if you want to calculate average speed for fixed distance In that case, harmonic mean is, is very good and useful, right? So, for a particular distance, if you want to calculate average speed, you could do this way. So, I hope that helps you to understand, one, the concept about harmonic mean, how it is to be applied, and how to calculate when given some questions. Thanks for watching. Feel free to write comments. You can share and subscribe to my videos. Thank you and all the best.